always knew uh, that I learned differently. I mean, in college, I would, um, I'd have to study like 10 hours a day to get a B or a C. And I always felt like I know the information, but I can't retrieve the information <laughs> or yeah. I can't retain the information. Um, and, and, and so I just kept on changing my major and, and I, it was interesting. My parents always told me I was smart. So I always thought I was smart. You know, I never like looked at it as if I was, I just knew I learned differently, but you know, it was a different time back then. The parents weren't helicopter parents, like, you know, like they are today. It was kind of like, I don't even, I mean, I talk about this with, you know, friends of mine and colleagues now, like where were our parents to be like, you know, shouldn't we do something? <laughs> shouldn't we do something about this? You know, get this kid some tutors or, you know, something, but you know, it was, it was what it was. And so I had to figure out how I studied. And so I just, or how I learned. And so I, I studied a lot, but what I found was, especially during my, in my early twenties and in college, I spend so much time every day. I always walk to class or I'm dating myself or I would bike to class, walk to class or rollerblade to class. And, it. um, but it was, you know, this is now 30 years ago and I would listen to books on tape. I would listen to all of these people. So I always felt like I was getting like an A plus in the people I was listening to and learning from. And in school, I, I didn't really, I knew I was doing the best I could. So if I got an A, great. If I got a B, great. If I got a C, great. If I got a D, I would go negotiate with my with my teacher and hopefully get it up to a C. And so I, you know, I didn't, and so that was that. And then, and then I started a company when I was 23, right out of college. I started an internet company with my brother and a buddy of ours. And because of all the studying I had done, self-study, I was the one business planning for us, leading a lot of the business planning talks, um, leading the sales team, leading the sales, growing the sales team, doing everything I learned at, with the tapes, not much of what I learned in my double major of journalism and economics, right? Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. But I learned discipline. You know, to me, I mean, I had fun in college. I, you know, I went to college with a lot of my best friends, but I learned discipline. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, that's really good. And then I have to hit on, uh, I have uh, plenty of friends now that are getting back into rollerblading. So I think it's coming back. It's full <laughs> it circle. So back. you're, you're hip it again is. now saying yeah, that you rollerbladed you. <laughs> 30 years ago. So <laughs> yeah, I actually got rollerblades, uh, during the pandemic and was rollerblading with my kids when we were in lockdown, you know, it's like you oh, wow. tried to buy them as fast as you could. So you, because there wasn't a lot to do. So yeah, no, that makes sense. Yeah. 